Can you find the pH of this buffer solution given the following pKa values without a calculator? Because phosphoric acid is a triprotic acid where every time we lose a proton, we have a different pKa value, pKa 1, 2, and 3. This buffer uses NaH2PO4 and Na2HPO4. We have to use Ka2, where this is our acid and this one's our base. To find the buffer pH, we'll use the henderson hasselbalch equation. pH is equal to pKa plus the log of conjugate base over acid which is equal to pKa2 of 7.21 plus the log of 0.49 divided by 0.053. We have two ways to solve this. Option one, we actually carry out the math where without a calculator, close enough is good enough. So we'll round 0.49 to 0.5 and 0.053 to just 0.05. If you can't see it right away, do the decimal trick, move it twice to the right for the top and bottom. This gives you 50 over 5, which reduces to 10 over 1. Log of 10 is equal to 1, making this entire expression just 1. This gives me a pH of 7.21 plus 1, which is equal to 8.21. Simple enough, but even faster way is to use the estimation that pH is equal to pKa plus a correction factor where that correction looks at the impact of the conjugate base to acid ratio. Since the correction factor has to do with logs of base 10, every log 10 is a pH unit of one. Meaning, if the acid or base is 10 times stronger, it will change the pH by one unit in either direction. Looking at the initial math, I recognize approximately 0.05 to 0.5. This one is 10 times more dilute, meaning my buffer is 10 times more basic. 10 times more basic means that I have one log unit in the direction of base. My correction factor is one 10x value, one log unit, what will make the pH of 7.21 more basic. Raising the pH makes it more basic by one log unit for a new pH of 8.21. Calculator says 8.18, which is close enough. For even more practice on pH and buffers without a calculator, just comment worksheet below.